Minnesota voters crowned Democratic Representative Tim Walls and 2014 GOP nominee Jeff Johnson, their party's front runners for Governor Tuesday, as preference polls at precinct caucuses provided the first glimpse at the wide open race. Those caucuses marked the first step in each party's march toward nominating conventions in June, an early chance for Democratic and Republican voters to get involved in selecting delegates and crafting new platforms. But at 4,000 plus precinct sites across the state, the straw polling in the governor's race was the main event, and Johnson won more than 45% of caucus votes, according to the Republican Party's unofficial results. That's triple his nearest competitor, former GOP Party Chairman Keith Downey. And Walls, seeking the Democratic nomination for governor after six terms in Congress, was leading five Democratic challengers by at least 10 percentage points, with about 95% of the votes tallied. Johnson and Walls will get a boost from their commanding finishes in the polls, and poor performances could drive other candidates out of the race. State Representative Paul Thiessen has already announced that he is dropping out. And there's also a wrinkle in the Republican race for governor. Former Governor Tim Pawlenty is considering a third run at the state's top job. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.